Hey guys, Gamer of Gamers in the Zone, and welcome to what should be the real finale to Hyrule Warriors Age of Calamity. It better not reveal that I'm still wrong. Anyway, we're getting into the final battle. So I don't think I'm going to cook anything this time. Last time I cooked the fairy tonic because I was thinking this would be the final battle, but... I still don't know the, if this is, so I'm just going to go in without any food. But this is it. The true... So, here you all are. All of you despicable pests. You again. You're going down, man, and Ganon as well. Yeah, it's exactly what you think. That's like a some kind of futuristic... Some sort of futuristic... You're going down, man. This is it. First, this prophet dude is going down. And will be taken down Ganon. So this is interesting. So, expensive battle over... Uh, interior of royal buildings. Deliberately complex data in the castle's defense. So, unlike Breath of the Wild, where things were a bit more, you know determined, I guess. Here is where things are going to get more interesting, because with two, you know, R2-D2s, one good and one evil, it's really deciding, you know, who's going to be winning here. Will it be Ganon? Or will it be, uh... Will it be the good guys? It all comes down to this. Harbinger Ganon. Calamity Ganon's malice pursued Tarako from the future, possessing the original Tarako that was already here. Oh, I get it. Okay. That would actually make sense then. Final battles of possible. We knight with our power to be sharpened and seal away Calamity Ganon. The one that's from before seemed to be lying in wait in the back of the castle. We disappear in the direction of the first and second gate houses. We must defeat them first. Defeat Astoran Harbinger Ganon. Oh, I don't remember that being part of the combo. I must have didn't try that one out yet. But I should have. Also, where am I going in the castle here? A trap. We'll defeat them. And soldier on. There are a lot of enemies in here. Oh my goodness. Take out the weak points. Done. Our future is safe in your capable hands. Thank you very much. What is that thing? Um... I don't know what's happening right now, but okay. Also, what did I just deflect? I honestly have no idea what's going on. This is like... This is too intense of a final battle. We just started in...
I messed that up. Okay, this is really cool though. For a final battle, I really wasn't expecting this. Valiant ever, but not enough. You'll find this was over long before it began. Astor has summoned the Blight Ganons. Uh oh. We need not fear. We will not lose. Alright, defeat the Blight Ganons. I don't know where to go in the castle. Ooh, let's go try and Daruk and their allies out. So a big bet, good time. You're gonna pay for everything you've ever done. Daruk and their allies have begun moving. Alright, I'm heading in the direction of one of the blights. Which should be right in here. There he is. We'll start off with a big attack like that. I sure do keep having to fight you guys a lot more often than usual. Won't be lasting very long, though, that's for sure. Uh, where did he go? Okay. I am never ready for that. Always ready for the Sheikah Slay attacks, though. Ah. Three, four, five. That attack isn't going to work, clearly. So, and then another interesting question I have is, is where exactly would the Prophet be in the original Breath of the Wild? That's, uh, another question I kind of have. So, what exactly is the structure here? Cause there, okay, so there's three different levels to the castle. I'm not sure which is the best route for each pathway. So that way was our way in. That's the upper layer. No. Irritating fools. This will put a stop to your meddling. The Guardian was reinforced by Aster. Ryan's approaching from behind. We got this. Sidon and their allies have appeared. Um. Okay, I was a little bit worried about that at first, but it looks like we got him. Okay, wasn't ready for that. And we dealt a good hit to the Malice Guardian.
I'd say the charged attacks are good for like Seems like the charged attacks, like strong attacks, still deal some good damage. All right, let's go, Fire Blight. Okay, wasn't quite ready for that attack. Ready for that attack, that's for sure. I was not expecting that to actually count as a flurry rush. Never ready for that attack, though. I. Get out of here. Oh, yeah, his one weakness was always the bombs, wasn't it? Okay, I'll be honest, I... Alright, let's on... Okay, I wasn't ready for the Sheikah Slate thing, but I guess we're, uh... What are you doing? I can't tell. Yeah, except he still landed on a hit on me, that's for sure. This guy is demolishing me right now. Had not been for the difficulty alteration, I... I would not be lasting very long against this guy. Unless his guard's down. You're still the best, Link. Thank you very much. Alright, is the next wave of Malice gonna go away now? No? Alright, also, how are the others doing? Like, we got the king over there. We got... Supposedly that going for us, so we gotta figure out now. We gotta figure out where we're, we gotta go next. I'm gonna try over here. Because it does look like there's a path upwards through here. Oh wait, no, that's the way we came in. So is there no way through that way? No, where's the king at right now? Oh, the king's right at where Water Blight's at. Oh my goodness. Ah, wasn't ready for the attack. A lot of these attacks I never seem to be ready for. I only gotta deal one more hit to him. There we go. That ought to get his guard down, and now for another massive hit.
Ah, I wasn't ready for that attack. How did that not work? Okay, I'm get I'm ready for ya. Okay, wasn't getting hit that time. Okay, now that works. Alright, this last hit should take him down. There we go. And it says the other blight is right over here. But I don't see him. Okay, maybe he's not on this level. If that's the case. Zelda seems to know where it's at. Also, I see this back here. What do we got back here exactly? Nothing? What is the whole point of this secret area if there's nothing back here? Alright, let's try heading out here. Zelda seems to know the way forward. Okay, so it's up here. Yeah, this was always the most annoying out of all the Blight Ganons. switch to, over to Zelda for a moment. Just so we can have a bit of variety in who we play as. Strike down. That is my destiny. My true calling. So I'm definitely finding it a lot more useful to... Should deal another hit to him. Okay, well, I wasn't ready, quite ready for that. Alright, so I notice I gotta, like, be smart in when I choose to go into that, like, form that, like, gives, like, the ultimate power. Or that, like, she, like, uses the Bow of Light to attack, because when I don't attack at the best time, that's, like... I should be smart in how I attack. Uh, well, parts like these, when I not successfully knock them down, is a good opportunity to, to attack. Yeah! But defeat Aster and the Harbinger Ganon. Okay. So in here, what do we got going on in here?
Is that Harbinger Ganon? Okay, that's Harbinger Ganon. So, I mean, Zelda's taking on Harbinger Ganon now. Oh, dear. Catalyst of the Calamity. Oh, dear. That thing looks like General Grievous now. First, uh, R2... We go from R2-D2 to Gen... It's like our little one. So when did it... Didn't quite get the opportunity to read that. So I gotta know when the best time to attack is. Otherwise... There we go. I flurry rushed it. This is actually kind of cool. Oh, oh, what's it doing? Alright. Take that, Harbinger Ganon. Guardians have appeared. Master Koga and their allies have appeared. Okay, that'll do some good damage. Okay, I wasn't quite ready for that. Oh, come on, they're so close to... How is that guy still... Okay, there we go. Um, I don't like the look of that. Except I managed to fight it off at least, but what was that? And I exactly have enough time to... Did I hit him? Okay, I hit him. Alright, Harbinger Ganon is almost finished. This ought to finish him off. Harbinger Ganon has withdrawn for now. Ah! Defeat Astor. Alright. Link's turn to go up against Astor. You, I will sever your thread once and for all. Oh boy. It's like the Dark Link fight. Okay. I really have to keep my guard up here. Otherwise, yeah, I'm going down. If I'm not careful. Alright, let's take out the Dark Link copy. So we can focus all out on taking out Astor. We don't even know who Aster is, because he never showed up in the original timeline. Other than that, he was just... And, of course, I miss him. Why do I keep hearing the weakness noise like something just showed up that... Eh, I don't know, but right now my focus is on taking out Astor. Ha! 
Can't get away from me that this time. That's gonna do anything to me. I'm the hero, buddy. And now you're about to get another big hit from my sword. Oh dear. What are you doing? Okay, I should pay attention. Oh, man. I... Mm. Alright, let's take out the uh, fake Link again. First dark replicas of... Everyone else. Now dark replicas of... Of Link himself? A rather interesting twist, I will say, though, considering... It. Like, this is the closest we'll get to facing having, like, a Dark Link fight in the Breath of the Wild series, I'd say. Excuse me, what was that? Oh, dear. Okay. What do you got for me now? Dude, that does nothing. Never seen to properly get that set up correctly. Alright. That ought to finish Aster off. The story of my triumph was written long ago. How dare you try to efface it? Aster is withdrawn for now. You are not getting away, buddy. The Malice Swamp has disappeared. Alright. I am Calamity Gan's right hand. An emissary of fate itself. I cannot be beaten. We cannot let the machine this machine escape. Def time we def we have no option but to defeat them. But first I see a Korok here. I I just noticed that. Defeat Harbinger and At Aster and Harbinger Ganon. All right, we're coming for you, buddy. You're going down. Oh dear, what is going on over here? Strength is a constant. All right, where's this other guardian at? going down. So even though we don't control them all, a lot of our allies are here. A lot of the our allies, those who may have been once our enemies. Link, there you are. Oh. 
<laughs> Link, I'm counting on you now. Don't worry, we got this. Link, I willingly place my life in your hands. I messed that up big time. There we go. Oh, is this pathway still... Okay, no, it's not. So we go up here. I'm just trying to find the path to... Okay, here they are. So they're both over here. So, so now do I have to fight them both at the same time? Because if so, that's going to be brutally challenging. Alright, you're going down. Uh, uh. How the great calamity Ganon selected me. This humiliation cannot be my destiny. It cannot be. Well, yeah, that Ganon, Ganon it also is facing such humiliation. Yeah, I knew this would happen. What'd you think would happen? Following Calamity Ganon. Oh, this is something else. But yeah, you're not the one to command Ganon. He commands you. What just happened? Oh, ho. So this is... Oh, this is interesting. So we have to fight like a... Fusion... Between Astor and... It, this form of Ganon. Oh, dear. Oh, no. You better not turn as well. Dude, stop. We did not come this far only for you to turn on us. No. Zelda, use your powers. You can... Save him. Seems we have no resource but to fight. Alright, defeat the controlled guard. Oh, we have to take this thing out first? Oh, dear. I mean, on one side, like, I want to... I actually wasn't expecting it to come to this. I know chronologically, yeah, like, uh... Like, a. Uh, I thought it was, like, going to be a, few, a good R2-D2 versus bad... R2-D2, but this is someone else, something else entirely. I'm, like, in a position where I'm, like, I don't want to fight him, but, like, I kind of have no choice if I want to save him.
Okay. Okay, will that be enough to save him? Come on. This can't happen to you now. Not after all the hard work. No! Are you serious? I didn't want to do this. I... That... I was not expecting this. I had to fight what was our ally. The one that kind of helped us get this far and like... A good attempt to change fate. This is sad. <laughs> oh my goodness. She built that herself? Are you serious? Okay, maybe not completely built herself, but maybe like fixed it up to get it working again. Because there's no way she could have built a time-traveling robot all on her own. has been foretold. Oh. As the princess of Hyrule, your sole focus must be on your training. Alright, I get that they made up and all, but like, I really don't like... Th this is... This is one instance where I do feel like the king is going just a little bit too far in terms of trying to like get Zelda to like focus on her training. Wow. That is sad. I mean, you could always repair him, right? <coughs> Alright, that's it. You're going down, Ganon. He's going down. For our future. This is where you fall. All right, Zelda's angry. Let's onward. We'll see you, Calamity Ganon, with our own might. Clan Ganon seems to have moved toward the Sanctum, possibly to gather power. Hurry. Seal Calamity Ganon. We're going in. Head towards the Sanctum to Seal Calamity Ganon. So are we going to get a similar boss fight to what we got back in Breath of the Wild? I mean, obviously we still got to take out the other, the evil Terrico. But anyway, this... Oh, I see the face. Oh, dear. Hatred and Malice Incarnate Calamity Ganon. There he is. We end this here and now. I will see you, you away and return peace to Hyrule. 
I refuse to fall here. Alright, let's start with a special attack and... Oh, his attacks aren't doing it. Can I do anything with Zelda? It's like, maybe I have to specifically hit him with, like, the Bow of Light. Our power cannot reach it. So this is the true might of Calamity Ganon. What can we do? Yeah, none of our attacks are working on it. Even though that's supposed to be the power to seal Calamity Ganon. Technically. No, you don't. We're trying to change fate. It won't end that easily. She's trying. You got this. Is it going to be like What was that? It straight up blew him up. Still did nothing. Wow. Alright, that's it. You're going down. This is it. It's time to finish you off for good. Now our power reach, thanks to you, Tarako. Alright, I'm switching over to Link. Because Link's supposed to be the hero in this case. But oh boy, Calamity Gan is not going down easily, I'll tell you that much. What to expect is the problem. He's definitely putting up a fight compared to all the other uh, foes we've gone up against. This is a fight. Alright, we've dealt one good hit to Calamity Ganon. Now for... Okay, I wasn't quite ready for that. What even caused my... Sheikah Slate to... Okay, I gotta know when to properly do that. Okay. Um. Oh, come on. I wasn't ready for that. What else you got? 
There we go. We got a successful flurry rush off of him. Take that. Alright, I'm taking a moment to play as all the characters here. felt good. I still don't entirely know if this is supposed to be like a... If this is supposed to be like the evil Taraka or just Calamity Ganon himself. that, Ganon. Alright, what else you got? We got him down to half health. Oh, are we going to the actual arena now? Where the real fight's gonna begin? It's time. Settle the score once and for all. Like that, or okay. Uh, I'm you're gonna have to get off so I can attack the weak point. Definitely not going down easily, that's for sure. Okay. Calm down, Ganon. Yikes. worth it. Oh wait, no, that's the wrong button, and I wasted a perfectly good Sheikah Slate ability. Alright. Finish off that part of the fight, I'll go ahead and unleash that. To deal some good damage. And then... 
Go back to Link. Should only take a few more ta- That'll do it. One last finish. And that ought to finish him off. That was a cool finisher, how you like... Deliver one last blow before finishing him off. Or like, weaken his guard one last time. That was pretty cool. Oh, is he going straight for that? Oh, yeah! Okay, that was pretty cool. Alright, that's it. It's over, Ganon. Finish him off. It's over, Ganon. You're finished. Wow. Now that was a final battle. Definitely feels like a more proper fight compared to what we went up against in Breath of the Wild, where it was like we had a ugly form of Calamity Ganon, and then like his Dark Beast form was just stupidly easy. But here it was like... That felt like a more proper fight against Calamity Ganon, that's for sure. That should do it. Ganon is history. <laughs> and this time, everyone made it out alive. Now my question is, are the ones from the future stuck here now, or... Will they eventually return to their timeline? That's my question. Because it's going to be pretty odd if we're just stuck with people from the future here. Yep, you guys. Well then, it seems the time has Your purpose has been fulfilled. I could not be prouder. It was an honor to be of service. <laughs> yeah, I didn't I expect you, you guys to see even come from the future. <laughs> Thanks for everything, you know. You didn't get much time in there. You'll always cherish it. I will too! It was so much fun. You're the best, Garuk. Alright. This has been enlightening. I even got to see the face behind the champion. <laughs> I know that we'll meet again, dear brother. All right. Yes. You're my beloved sister, and our hearts will never be apart. <laughs> that was nice. Yeah, so much went down. Like, wow. And with that... Ganon is finished. They're returning to their own timelines. With that, peace got brought to Hyrule 100 years earlier. time.
Well, that was quite the finale. In terms of everything that happened, uh, there was a lot I wasn't expecting. Like, I, I mean, it, you could make the excuse that, like, there was a lot that happened toward, you know, being a bit of a fake out of the deaths. I'll admit I was probably like many others in thinking that this was just going to be like, um, you know, a build up to the events of what happened 100 years ago. I wasn't expecting this to like be its own branching timeline where, you know, thanks to some time travel nonsense that, you know, the Great Calamity was stopped much quicker, as well as some of our favorite characters finally getting their happy ending like because chronologically you know that means Ur Urboso will remain chief um Rivali is gonna well remain Rivali I'm guessing and uh Daruk is gonna probably continue to lead the Gorons well and then as for Mipha I mean if we consider the events of Breath of the Wild. For those who don't know if they actually didn't play Breath of the Wild up to watching this video, Mifo, before she died in Breath of the Wild, was technically engaged to Link. Meaning that. Th this means Link and Mifa are finally gonna get married in this timeline. Which I don't know uh, if we're actually going to get to see that, but I sure would it be willing to see like some of the after story here if Nintendo's going to do that. Probably not. They're probably going to like hide it behind like the expansion pass. Which, uh, in case I didn't explain it yet, I don't think I'll be getting the expansion pass. Mainly because most of it seems like a ripoff, because at least in Breath of the Wild, a lot of the items you receive in the expansion pass were, like, useful in making exploration easier, and, like, finding certain things that, you know, maybe aren't easy to find without them, like the Korok seeds. But here, it feels like the game's already complete, and, like, it doesn't need DLC. So it sort of leaves me in a position to where I really don't think this thing needs DLC. And whatever DLC we get, like, it all seems unnecessary. The story part of all of this really doesn't seem like it would be enough. If you ask me. Oh yeah, this part. Yeah, I'll be honest. I'm still kind of confused as of, like with what happened with Tarako there, or as I like to call him, uh, the, uh, um, Legend of Zelda version of R2-D2. So, clearly, uh, the one that got possessed by Ganon, it, like, absorbed Astor within that moment, and somehow that's what, like, caused it to achieve Ganon's, like, final form. It really didn't make a lot of sense to me. Nonetheless, I still thought it was a pretty good final battle. I do still think my previous mi or my favorite mission was the one before, where um, uh, everyone uniting together. All right, executive producers: Sashi, Komuma, Shantaro. I didn't get to read all that. My apologies if I mispronounced those names. But a good game. Again, though, the DLC seems kind of unnecessary. I'll probably just be looking up the, that DLC online just to see if there is any kind of story content, which I doubt there is. Okay. So I think we're just going to be wrapping things up here. Ooh, my dear Lionel Crusher. Okay. 
terms of what's happened, though, I do think that... Why are we getting weaker weapons when he already has, like, the strongest claymore? I don't get it. I do definitely have some experience to gain with some of the other characters that I didn't get to spend much time playing as. There are still a ton of side quests for me to do, but I think I'm going to do all that offline. I'm sure most of you are here for this Let's Play for the story. Uh, same for me. I, I was mainly here for the story the whole time. I'll definitely be putting some time into some of these side missions, though. Just for the enjoyment of completing it, but... Oh, that's it? And with that, a few more side quests show up. So that technically means now that... Wait, is there a way to repair him, seeing how I'm seeing like a lot of the robot ones showing up? There is way too much going on at all at once. Taraka repairs. By collecting ancient parts and gaining the aid of the people of Hyrule, you will surely be able to repair Taraka. Obtained Mifa Daruk, uh, Ravali, and Urbosa's attire. Taraka's return. Okay. But yeah, this is definitely something I'll be doing on my own time. What is this about, exactly? The Master Chief. You've met a cha talented chef who has cooked for years at Hyrule Castle. He's bent on mastering a culinary creation to ask you to buy him lots of ingredients. Okay. Well, that being said, I do still have a long ways to go until I've truly completed this game. That's one thing's for sure. Other than that, though... I'd say we're finished in terms of this Let's Play. I'll probably still be putting some time into it on my own time, but that'll be of my own leisure. And we'll see where that goes. So, that being said... Uh, thank you very much for watching this with me. This Let's Play definitely went in some directions in terms of attempting to do it for, like, a... Uh, Friday streaming, along with, like, trying to... I attempted a bunch of things with this, and I think it was mainly me trying to see how I could mix this well with, like, college and stuff. Which, yeah, I guess wasn't exactly the best time, but that's how it goes, I guess. So that being said... Thanks very much for watching. I'm going to go ahead and uh, just save progress here. That being said, we're about done here. I think I've stated all that I've stated or wanted to talk about. And that being said, that about does it. Now... In terms of uh, what I'll be playing next, I'll definitely be continuing my playthrough of uh, Breath of the Wild hard mode on Friday streaming, if I haven't finished that by the time this is uploaded. And uh, another thing is... Uh, what else? I think that's about all for me to say, but... Nonetheless, I'm glad I took the time to play this game. I have no idea if the events of this alternate timeline uh, will come into play with the sequel to Breath of the Wild. I mean, it could for all that I know. I would bet it would, knowing Nintendo. Um, they'd find some way to put it in there. That being said, though, we are finished here. I mean, they could release, like, another kind of Hyrule Historia explaining how maybe this event could tie in, or, like, how the events of all the previous Zelda games tie into the Breath of the Wild series, and how it, like, 
there's a lot for Nintendo to explain still, and who knows, maybe they'd still, like, be going off in its own direction and just having Breath of the Wild be its own thing outside of the main chronological timeline that they've created, which I still don't know if it, that was a good move on their part or not, considering how messy it is. That being said, thank you for very much one last time for being with me here and as always if you enjoyed this let's play series and wish to see more of my uh, content in the future in terms of what other what other games I uh, might be playing make sure to leave a like and subscribe and click the notification bell to stay notified of future uploads and until next time this is the gamer of gamers and stay excellent everyone